Alright then folks, we're off to Lumi's. Three of us going today. We've got Winks, he'll be on a BMW R1200S. And then we got John. We're meeting him up in Wareham. He um going to pick his bike up from the uh, repair shop. We had a little trip to to Wales in October. I think it was uh, five of us went. John decided to throw his uh, Z750 at one of the stone walls up through the Clamberis Pass. Thankfully he wasn't hurt. It's more than we could say for the bike. Uh, as I say, he's picking it up today after all the repairs. Full tank, so that should be good for 200 miles. First time I've had a go at this, it uh, seems a bit weird talking to yourself. Mind you, in my house, I'm the only one I get any sense out of. Well, Mr. Missenden Flyer, you get white vans, we get lorries and tractors. Joy's a Dorset. I'm always a bit more uh, wary than Mike is of putting this into the corners as it's a mega thin front wheel on this. I think the tyre profile is 90 by 90. You know, he's uh, geared up a lot more for off-road than on it. Anarchy 3 tyres. I see quite a few people call them panickies. Uh, touch wood. No, I'm not going to say that. I'm not going to tempt fate. SF800 does have self cancelling indicators. What I try and do is keep it in my mind I cancel it all the time because obviously when I do get a bike that's not self-cancelling I want to stay in the habit of cancelling them myself God I love them nationals
30 in the 30s, let her have it in the Nationals. On down to Dorset and have a ride round that. Can't beat the smell of fresh Dorset shit. Somebody's been shit flicking. <laughs> Obviously, uh, foreign going round the roundabout on the right hand side Better. Get rid of them bloody cars. Lovely little road that is, beautiful. And the old F800 don't do bad, I say it's not built for that. But she does do well. John, you definitely need a bigger bike. You can't be six foot twenty and ride one of them. Again, this is a nice little road. 
the only thing uh, some of the tight bends you get do get uh, lorries coaches nice bit of road though This thing obviously hasn't got the engine brake in that, uh, especially that beamer up in front. I don't know whether the old SJ cam's still working. You're looking at about 40 minutes, I think, on them batteries. I have got the uh, extended ones, <laughs> which takes it up to about 55 minutes to an hour if you're lucky. Whereas the old Drift Ghost X, that lasts five hours apparently. This will be the first time that I've sort of tested that to that capacity. Gonna be out for a few hours today, so we'll see how it does. And I rest my case, John. It's too small for you. Look at those f***ing feet. Sandy balls. I see. <laughs> Old gravel bollocks, eh? Old gritty nuts. Pebular testicles. <laughs> Oh my god, they've got it all going on out here. Look, they've got a couple of fighting cocks now. The fighting cocks. Lovely neck of the woods this is. Just coming across the top of the old uh, New Forest now. It is lovely though. Look at it. Absolutely gorgeous. And you do need to stick to the 40 mile an hour state you through here. You never know when uh, one of those horses is going to come flying across the road. I wonder how many horses a year get killed through here. You get your idiots belting through here at night time. Johnny, it's my mission in life to get you on a bigger bloody bike. Not one that will take your height, one that will cope with those feet. Look at them! This through here, bloody lovely. Aye aye, aye ho silver. Oh, your collar looks a bit tight.
I don't think I've seen one house yet that's um, not been nice. Please tell me that is not a pig. Jesus Christ! <laughs> That's a fatter pig than I am. <laughs> Massive! A few bacon butties there. Works access. Bit of a contradiction in terms there because I can't see any f work going on at all. I'll wager a bet you don't sit behind that very long. That's the beauty of riding bikes. Get past nice and safely, get back in on your own side of the road. I'm just hoping that all of this um, waffle that I've been dribbling on about is actually being picked up by the microphone. I'll make your boy peddling like a good look, try not to hold the lorry up too much. Oh yeah, mustn't forget that, 31st of March, Mother's Day. So, never been to Lumi's before. Seen umpteen uh, videos on YouTube where people have been there. Um, looking at the route we're going back home, 272, A30, should be a nice, should be a nice ride on the way back. liable to flood in, well that's not today. Local swimming pool.
Yeah, I think on the whole we've been um, pretty lucky with the choice of roads so far. Not the odd hold up, but nothing, nothing too drastic. Certainly a beautiful part of the country. It's obviously a cyclist route. Not far now, I recognise West Meon, I think uh, Lumi's is just up the road. And it's quarter to twelve, just in time for lunch, look. And here's Loomis, infamous Loomis. I think pheasants have got to be the thickest f***ing birds on the planet. The amount that you see dead in the road. Alright, now that they're bloody gone, hopefully we can get a shifty on. I think I'm going to have to put this microphone back behind the cheek pad. I spent the last half an hour probably rolling it around off of my lips. 